So today I am going to uh, do a quick review on this uh, uh, booty. Uh, so what is it called? Ah yes, booty oil and masala extractor. So yeah, with this package I got this uh, uh, user guide book. So where they have given the instructions on how to uh, do the operation of this uh, uh, oil extractor. We also call it as a um, cold press. So it can be used to extract oil from any kind of uh, seed. So today I am going to test with uh, my uh, the cocoa nibs. So these are the fresh cocoa nibs from our cocoa plantation. So we have a cocoa plantation in our backyard. So I picked some you know, cocoa nibs and we have to you know, uh, roast it or we have to make it uh, little pieces like this. So you can't you know, uh, put them as a whole. So better you make them piece and keep them ready. So next step is, yeah, if you come closer so I can show you. So there is a, a lock and unlock uh, option here. So just you have to turn it. So it will uh, uh, unlock and don't try to lock it. Uh, I was trying to lock it back so it will not uh, happen. So, so just lift it. So you can uh, remove this. So this is the piece of uh, equipment where it the exact uh, the actual process will happen. So put it back. Then you can lock it. Unlock, but you can't lock, but you have to hold it straight, then you can lock it. Okay, so next we have this uh, feeder, so where you can feed the raw material. So insert it. Now, next thing is you have to pour whatever the raw material you have. But before that, uh, yeah, let me show you uh, some other items. So we have uh, this uh, filter and we have this uh, 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 container to store the oil. So we have to put this filter on top of this. Keep it nicely. Keep it here. So the first outlet will give you the oil. In our case, it will be cocoa butter. Here I will collect the. Uh, uh, whatever the substance which you know comes out after extracting the oil or butter or pure cocoa powder. So let's keep it here. Okay, so before I start uh, extracting my cocoa butter, so I'll you know weigh this uh, uh, the weight of this uh, cocoa nibs. So let me check the weight. So it is almost uh, 200 grams. So uh, the nice feature of this uh, device is you have to uh, close the lid, otherwise you know it will not uh, uh, start. So even if I switch on the power supply, so you can't uh, switch on. So you have to close this uh, lid. So there is a switch here which will go inside this. So make sure that this switch will press here and just close it. You can hear the beep. So then switch it on. And yeah, uh, I believe it's better to wait for at least one minute. So I'm now I'm going to turn on this machine after one minute. So yeah, uh, some of the important notes. So you can operate this machine for 25 minutes continuously. So once you operate this machine for 25 minutes, so you have to. Uh, put this machine into a rest for 10-15 minutes. So let me start. So the cocoa powder is already started coming out, but there is no sign of cocoa butter at
Yes, as you can see, a few drops have started. Yes. Not bad. Yeah, it's almost uh, uh, 80 grams of uh, cocoa butter uh, from 200 grams of uh, cocoa nibs. So, which comes uh, for around 40%. Uh, you know, um, yep, 40% is not uh, bad. Yeah, good. So, overall, good performance. So, thanks for watching the video. Bye.